right before you go through that door, turn left. Just all of a sudden. Oh, oh is it? Okay. Tell him we're back here. Nicole? Yeah. We're back here. <laughs> Tell you what, you guys want to oh. do a lights out thing? or? My neck was wrong with my neck. Holy shit. It's fucking red as shit. I'm not something even joking. Just, something I'm just grabbed my neck. It. Look at her neck, dude. Something just grabbed me. Oh, wow. That is super red. A big-ass spot. Oh, yeah. It's burning. It's yeah, very, very it violently red. I'm going to take a picture. Wow. Oh, my goodness. It's burning. Yeah. Yeah. And you're about to see why. What the fuck is that? <laughs> You heard a bump up there too, didn't you? Yeah. While you were recording? Mm-hmm. Yep, I did too. What the fuck? That's... I felt something, and then... Hey, check her neck out. I can't she see. She just got grabbed by like the neck. Bad. Who did? Melissa. Like Melissa. Really? Okay. Yeah. <gasps> it was burning. Oh, my Lord. What happened? Something in here. He started feeling weird. I was standing right here. Alright, hold on. Are you in here? That's you that touched her neck. I want you to touch mine. Grab me. People talking in the basement. Did you grab my neck? You didn't started burning and I went like this and I was like, what is that? And Ryan's like, um, <laughs> it's beet red. Can you touch me like you touched my friend? That's weird, it's like a whole circle. Yeah. Like, how would, I, how would that happen? Mm -hmm. you, like, you know, if I scratch myself, you know, you're going to see a lot. You would have to work on that for... A long time. And I, I think I was taping you the whole time, so... That's why I asked if you yeah. scratched you. No, I was just mm -hmm. like, just like this. Hmm. Man, there's nothing but death down. Come to me. Show me you're here. Dude, my neck is on fire. Like, it's burning. Yeah. It's, so it's like right where my cross is, right? No, it's above it, but... It's not gotten bigger. It's it's like yeah. yeah it's you know what? You you guys didn't do any protection prayers or anything before you. No, we didn't. You probably should have. It's like hot. Yeah. 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 In that In that corner. <laughs> Grab your leg too. Blessing everything again. Does that make you mad? No, she's 
happening over here? That's, so weird, like That's where I was hearing the noise. I tried to go on the other side of the wall, but there's nothing there. No, I can feel it over here, though. It's definitely something over here. Like in the corner up here. Okay, you see where the skull is right here on yeah. the wall? That's where I feel like it's solid. I'm trying to have Bolton like stand there. Oh my god, you can totally feel it. it's like staticky. Are you leaving? Blessing everything in the name of Christ. Tillman, you're going to be my guinea pig if you don't mind. I'm not going to bless you right now. I'm going to see if it tries to touch you. Okay? That's not a spirit. Is it to me? You could, oh, my you could taste it on the back of your tongue. That wasn't a spirit. Um, your ears oh are very red, you like it grabbed you. Yeah, it, it, it. You need to go. How about everybody go out with me? You, you want to stay? I'll stay by oh, myself. You want to stay or you want me to go? Why don't you leave me the camera? The okay. If you can. Yep. If you, if you, you will. Feel it? You want the light? Um, there's a switch on the side. Alright. We need to get her outside. I think everybody needs to go out right now. Hair standing up in my arms in here. Nowhere else. You back in your corner? No, I think we're dealing with more than one. Because when we felt it here, it was busy attacking her by the throat. She couldn't even breathe. Right. I think we've got more than one. And now I don't feel it. All I feel in here is like static. Yeah, like electricity, yeah, right? Yeah, like, like, yeah, exactly. No, no, she was standing right here. This is a and then when it was over here, she was just talking to them. And it literally grabbed her by the throat and she was gasping. <coughs> and you could see it forming, the imprints. That's the how it was with her, with her neck. I mean, she was literally standing right here. I mean, she dropped to her knees not being able to breathe. <clears throat> and it was over there. Like something is still over here. That's why I think we've got more than one. Something just moved over there, swear to God, right in the middle of that. Was it light? No. It was almost like a dog running across where the light is, but going that direction, not going to the light. Like the size of a dog. It changes right from here, there. Right I say you go from right about there, about 10 feet this it's way, and it's going to feel different. Yeah, it's right here. Walk right there between those pillars. You won't feel okay. it. Okay, it's all over me. Okay. No, it's not right there. That's what I said. It's right here. I walked up here, and it went away. As soon as you get to about right here, it stops. It's right above us. Wait, it's moving. I can feel it on my left arm.
Well, it grabbed Melissa's throat, grabbed her chest, grabbed her ear, because she was wearing a cross. That's the only thing that was different between her and Cole and I. She was wearing a cross. Maybe because she is sensitive, too. But she did not say her blessing before she came in. No, she did not. I staged and said my blessing before I came in today. I didn't do any of it. I mean, there's only so much we can do before they kick us out. Right? We have a heading, though. It's important we have a destination, don't we? That's serious. No bullshit. She was standing there just like we are here. Right. Where exactly were her hands? Her hands were right in front of her. You probably played back on there. I was either hand. taping him or taping her, but I was going back and forth. It, she didn't do that. You would have. She would have had to work at that. Yeah, I mean, that wasn't just. And a, I literally watched the red marks form when she said she couldn't breathe. Phone died, but man, it sucked. It was just out of nowhere. Yeah, it was. I got that one whiff of something over there by where she was standing. Yeah. When she broke down, I walked past her and I got a whiff of something I haven't smelled, and I walked past that same spot six times and I never smelled it until that one time. And it was enough to stop me dead in my tracks because I smelled it. Was it a, a sour, rancid type of? No, it was almost woodsy. Not like sage, not like nothing like that. It was almost like like evergreen. Yeah, I told her to go sit where that food truck was last time. So, I want to get her prayers with the other ladies. Anyone say anything before we walk out? No, that was really about the, the whole building. Hi, I'm Grizzly from 94.5 XKR here in Toledo, and last year when we were here at the convention doing an investigation, Jennifer, Joe, Jennifer and Joe from 222 and I it were, was where this young lady was down in the basement here at the Collingwood Art Center, and we had an entity come out of that same area, uh, tap me on the back of the neck, the temperature went down to like 10 degrees, and then it tapped Jennifer. You can see her shirt move and her hair fluff up and it ran into the chairs and the chairs moved. And we were having a conversation, once for yes, two for no, the chairs shaking a little bit. Then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, I says, oh my God, look at, what's that? It's not and here come a, a shape, a figure, couldn't make out if it was a man, woman, or what, but uh, we got, we got uh, touched. Uh, I'm not surprised that this happened. That is beet red, beet red in the ears, and uh, that's pretty intense. Not surprising because there's a lot of activity down there. Last year it was incredible. This was actually burning so bad that all I could think about was like how hot yeah. it was feeling. Right. You know, it was just burning hot, hot. Yeah. And so that was like the only thing I kept thinking of because I'm like, God, this is hot. Like I'm burning. All right, Kim. Yeah. Like it seriously, it seriously felt like a cigarette. Where? So, well, I guarantee you that was not I just an you when you're in the that car. was demonic. And there was more than one of them. Not do no. Harm. No. And then it'll be all over my neck and my ears. Oh my god, my ears. I've never felt it is in there. heat like that. Yeah. I mean, it felt, I don't even know, like a steam burn kind of. It seemed like it was trying to separate us. Okay, where there's a noise over here. Tell them to go look. There's noise right. over there. It was trying to separate us mm -hmm. for some reason.